Uh, we all have those people we love learning from, but don't settle for their relationship with God. Have your own. The most important thing you will ever learn is how to hear and obey God. That's why we're here. I want you to have a first-hand faith. I grew up in a very loving and supportive family. My dad was a pastor, my grandfather was a pastor, even my uncle was a pastor. So that put a lot of social pressure on me. Last couple years of high school, around 16, 17, my heart for the Lord had just kind of diminished. I realized that this wasn't of my own doing. It wasn't coming from my own heart. It was a second-hand faith. I was a drill sergeant in the Army uh, for about two years. During my time in the military, God really broke me down and He humbled me a lot. So I was on leave for a couple of days and I went back home. I just went to one of those early morning prayer services. I was sitting next to my family and I just heard some of their prayers. At that point, most of my family members knew what I was going through spiritually. And I just could, I could just hear in their prayers and in their cries that they hadn't given up on me. My heart was so moved seeing how much God cared for me and how much He really loved me. And that just made me want to learn more about Him again. After my discharge, I knew I wanted to do something music related. My parents really wanted me to find a biblically sound school. I didn't really think there'd be much of a difference between a regular college and like Bible college, but Texas Baptist College, man, it was something completely different. A few weeks ago in chapel, I heard a message about secondhand faith becoming a firsthand faith. There are sometimes some things that we do in church without even thinking. I realized that that was what my life kind of looked like. The secondhand experience and faith being passed on from my parents and the church culture around me becoming very personal and my own. And what I hope to do one day is what I've learned here is to help people sing unto God in a biblically correct way. To express their own firsthand faith by proclaiming it in their own hearts that this is my testimony, this is what I'm singing about, and that is my faith.